Hey guys, this is Ron Moore. How y'all doing today? Um, I just wanted to talk about a few things real quick. Uh, first of all, thank you for your support. You guys have been supporting my channel for a while now, and especially the chill streams. I know they're not the most popular of streams, but some of you do enjoy them, and so do I. And you still come in to leave a lurk for the chill streams. I really appreciate that. They really help the watch time hours. I'm at 3,388 watch time hours right now, close to 3,400. So slowly but surely, I'll hit the 4,000 hour mark. But I just want to say thank you very much for you guys helping out with that, with the chill streams. I really appreciate it. And as far as me scheduling streams, I know I did a poll and most of you voted for me to schedule my streams. But honestly, I'm just going to, I can't really always keep a consistent schedule when it comes to streaming. I know some of, some of you prefer a streaming schedule, and I, I, I wish I could, but I can't always be consistent for a number of reasons. Uh, mostly, I've been consistent every Monday night and every other Friday, but I just can't always do it. Something comes up, I might not feel good, or something something with the wife or something happened to where you know I got to reschedule or whatever postpone like I had to postpone the Mario World stream for a, for a, a certain reason and I mean it happens but you know I can't I just can't keep a consistent schedule so I'd rather not promise anything and set a schedule than to reschedule disappoint and some of you said well whether you schedule your streams or not I'm gonna we're gonna support you either way and that's fine I really appreciate that so unfortunately I'm gonna have to go back to I mean, some of you might not even care. I don't think most people really care. But for those that do care, uh, I cannot schedule my streams anymore. I can only maybe give you an idea of when I might be streaming a certain game or whatever. But I'm going to have to go back to impromptu streams where it's not going to be scheduled. And if you ask me, well, when are you going to stream next? Or when are you going to stream this next? I might give you an idea of when I might do a certain game next or whatever. The two streams I do have scheduled next are Donkey Kong Country Part 2, uh, Donkey Kong Country 2 Part 3, and Super Mario World on Friday, August 6th. I've already scheduled those. I don't want to cancel those right now. Since those are uh, streams I scheduled, I'm going to leave those up, and I should be able to uh, stream those games on the days I schedule them. If not, I apologize. You know, you know how it is. I'll just reschedule. And, yeah, so... Uh, that's it for that for the scheduling of the streams um, what else I want to talk about here um, again you guys know I've been grinding on YouTube and I'm close to the watch time hours and if I hit monetization great I'll enable the memberships and enable membership perks if I don't hit monetization like for whatever reason if YouTube says hey we denied your application for whatever reason then I'm going to start grinding on Twitch like I do on YouTube with the chill streams or whatever. I'll still stream on YouTube, but not as much as I would on Twitch. Um, if for some reason I did not reach monetization on Twitch, then I would just still stream for fun on both platforms. It's whatever. Plus me not scheduling. Going, going back to the scheduling. As far as the, once again, regarding the scheduling of the streams, uh, it puts a lot less pressure on me. If I don't schedule the stream, you know, then I won't be pressured to stream that day. Like, oh man, I'm not really not feeling like streaming today, man. I don't feel good. But it's not scheduled, so at least I won't disappoint anybody. So, I remember back, uh, maybe last year, I had a Super C No Death Run scheduled, and I had to cancel it, and Mega Dan texted me, hey, were you gonna stream tonight? I said, man, I'm sorry, dude. I got off work, and I'm feeling like crap. He goes, oh man, so disappointed. He wasn't mad at me. You know, he understood, but still, the fact that you know, I let people down, and I can understand that, you know, you're looking forward to seeing somebody stream a certain game, a certain challenge or whatever, and then, boom, your night's kind of, maybe your night's not ruined, but like, oh man, I was looking forward to that tonight, and so, without scheduling anything, at least that's a good, that's a bright side of not scheduling anything, like Magus advised me a while back, don't schedule anything, don't promise anything, because when you do that, and you happen to not fall through with it, you disappoint people, and, it, and plus, it, it, will, it will put a lot, a, lot, a lot less pressure on you if you don't schedule anything or promise anything. So, and I'm not like, you know, let's face it, just like Mega Dan, this is mainly going to be a hobby. I do hope to get monetized to, for side cash and to enable memberships, but this is just a hobby for me. I'm not going to grow to be a huge, big time streamer. That's not me being pessimistic. It's just, uh, you know, that's how it is. I just want to really do this for fun. 
and not so much work rather than just play. I mean, if this paid the bills, that'd be great, but it's not. You got to be a special certain type of streamer to make a lot of money to pay bills to make a living off a streamer. And that's not me. This is mainly for fun. If anything, side cash, you know, money on the side to do this. So, uh, again, thank you very much for the support on the YouTube channel for leaving the lurk. When you come in, even just to drop a like and then you leave, you know, hey, that's showing support. I thank you very much for that. Now, regarding Twitch, you guys know I'm on Twitch. I'm not so much grinding on Twitch, but I am close to affiliate because it's a lot easier to become an affiliate on Twitch and get monetized than it is on YouTube. And I had Twitch for a while. I still got the followers that followed me from a while back. And I've been streaming lately and almost close to affiliate, so that'd be cool if I do that as well. But Twitch is just mainly an extra, like something on the side right now, not so much grinding like I am on YouTube. Uh, but I am on Twitch. Please feel free to follow me on there as well. And I want to give a few shout outs here to people that have been supporting my channel a lot as of late. Of course, Mega Dan, he always supports my channel. Shout out to Mega Dan, shout out to Zombie GLT1. He uh, leaves a lurk in my streams all the time. And he really supports the channel. I really appreciate him. Big Boss 100, he also leaves a lurk. I appreciate him as well. Omega Ace Gaming for supporting my channel. A fun streamer. I love watching him. Who else? Mazen Power, ECW Power. He supports my streams as well. And uh, who else? I hope I don't forget anybody. Goblin215, big supporter of the channel. Bushido Blade Warrior, longtime friend of mine. He also leaves a lurk on the channel. And uh, Val187, she, she leaves a lurk a lot and it comes to my streams as well. As well as Mexico187, longtime supporter of mine. And uh, who else? Um, if I'm forgetting you, don't please forgive me because I'm trying to remember people at the top of my head and trying to get this video done and over with because it's supposed to be just a quick video just to get out there. But uh, if I forgot to mention you, you know, just just post in, in the comments, hey, you forgot me, man. You know, it's oh, sorry, you know, hey, you know, I'm cool with you too. Hulkarin, Hulkarin 100, uh, Level 1 Online, Retro Gaming Star, uh, Stampede Gaming. Uh, you guys are cool. I really appreciate you guys a lot. And again, if there's anybody who forgot, please forgive me. Uh, you know, so I want to thank you guys very much for your support. And I hope you have a great rest of your day. I'm out of here. I'm Ron Moore. God bless and take care.